Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name's David, and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the Vernet band writer. Uh, this is the pencil lead band writer. There's two different kinds you can get. You can get pencil lead and you can get grease pencil. Uh, this is also available as a band writer and it's also available as a TT. So there's actually four different options uh, that you could get with Vernet. And so if you're not familiar with what a band writer is, uh, this would be the time where I would normally show you a commercial, <laughs> right? Or their ad copy or something that would give you kind of a little bit more of information. But there's actually no, there's no commercial for this. There's no video. There's no uh, DVD instructions, in fact. There is no uh, video instruction at all. And so really, um, you kind of already have to be in the know, for one, uh, to know what uh, a nail writer is, or maybe uh, you've known these as a Swami gimmick, okay? Um, but I can read the ad copy for you. I actually have the uh, write-up right here. So I can just read it for you, and I thought we'd just, we'll just make our own commercial, okay? We'll make our own commercial, even though Vernet didn't supply one, all right? So here we go. <clears throat> Renee Band Writer, commercial, take one. The most powerful tool that a magician can use now in a new model, ultra comfortable, ultra stable, and ultra grip. Vernet Band Rider was specifically designed to have a firm grip to the fleshy pad of your thumb and keep it absolutely invisible for your audience. Vernet Band Rider is ideal for those who couldn't find themselves comfortable with other writers. There you go. That's the commercial. <laughs> And so you did see a little picture of it there. That's not my picture, that's the manufacturer's picture. So I don't feel like uh, there's any exposure there because that picture comes from the manufacturer. That's their picture they put on the web when you wanna buy it. So that's, that's on them, not on me, okay? All right, so a couple of questions we always ask about all of our magic reviews, and the first of which is, what is in the box? What's in the box? Well, you do get a box, okay? And it's this big, and it's about the size of your thumb. You get this little yellow push pin, you get these written instructions, and you get the band writer, which I'm showing you right now. Is it what I thought? Absolutely. Uh, it's a nail writer, it's a Swami gimmick, like I said. Um, I've had others of these in the past. I've had a grease one. Um, I currently own the Vernet uh, TT version. I own that one as well, so I have both of these now, and I both have them in uh, the pencil lead version, so it's exactly what I thought. If you have any mentalism books, uh, you're already familiar with these, I'm sure. How are the angles? The angles on this are really clean, really good. In fact, really the only angle that it's not good for is from behind. And so if you already have experience with a TT, uh, then I'm sure you're already familiar with any angles that would be involved with a band rider. Can it be inspected? There's really nothing to inspect. You know, in a traditional trick, you would have a pad of paper maybe, or a notepad and a pencil, a visible pencil. And so all of those props that your spectator is viewing they could inspect all of those things because your uh, band writer is supposed to be a utility, therefore it is supposed to be invisible. So there's nothing for them to inspect. So if you do it right, there shouldn't be anything for them to inspect. Is it well made? Uh, yes, I have both. Like I said, I have the TT version and I have the band version. Which one do I like better? Uh, I like the band version over the TT version only because in the uh, TT version, you know, they always don't fit or match your skin tone or they don't actually look like they're a part of you. Um, with the band writer, so much more of your thumb is actually exposed and therefore you just feel more confident using your own finger. You know what I mean? Like more of your finger is there and it's just, it becomes more, I don't, you know, I don't know how to describe it. You just feel more in control, okay? So m your, your full uh, fingernail is, is seen, so you don't have a fake fingernail. You know, it's your fingernail. And uh, you just feel more in control of uh, what you're doing for me. So at least this is the one I prefer. But it's completely well made, made out of strong material, looks exactly like your skin tone, should do you years and years worth of work. How much practice does it require? Um, it does take some practice only because it just takes some time to get used to, you know? Typically when we write, you know, you write like, I'm left-handed. You write like this, right? You write 
with several of your fingers. You don't write with one finger, especially not your thumb. So the moment you're given a pad and you have to now, uh, you know, put your pencil in the opposite hand, or or worse, you know, write with the hand that you don't normally write with, because you have to think about that. Because part of the trick is you're going to probably draw a circle and make an arrow and say, I'm going to put a prediction right here. And so this hand has to be clean, you know, free, I guess. And so maybe your uh, band writer is on the hand that you don't normally write with. So not only are you learning to write with a hand that you don't normally write with, but you're also learning to write with like one appendage, okay? So your uh, letters or your numbers won't actually come out perfect the first time, first couple of times, first several times. So you're gonna just have to practice, you know? Do this with a friend, do it with your spouse, and just sit there and make eights and sevens and twelves all day long with your thumb until you start to make something that looks a little bit more like you actually wrote it with your good hand. So I would argue, yes, it's gonna take some practice. How much setup and reset is there? Again, if you're already familiar with a TT or you've done TT work, um, it's no more setup or reset than that. Positives, what are the positives to the Vernet Band Writer? Um, with the Vernet Writers, you can trust that you've got a quality product, it's gonna remain hidden, and it's gonna give you all the comfort and the ability that you need. Negatives, what are the negatives to this? Uh, I can't really think of any. You know, it's a utility, like I said, uh, so th there shouldn't be any negatives to it because it is what it is, it's a prop, you know? So I, I can't give this any negative remarks at all. Is it worth your money? It's $18, $18, uh, and I think you can do hundreds, if not thousands of tricks with this. Um, what I would suggest is if you're gonna purchase this, then you probably already have some books on mentalism. If not, I would recommend uh, The 13 Steps to Mentalism, uh, a boon for all occasions is a great one and would certainly cover everything you would need to know about a Swami gimmick. Um, Practical Mental Effects is another great one. Uh, Tarbell Course in Magic uh, Volume 4, also really good. And so I would think you'd have to pick up something like that or have something like that to make this gimmick worth your money, okay? You'll need some teaching to go along with this utility. Who would like this? I think something like this is specifically designed uh, to target mentalists, okay? Somebody who's a mentalist, somebody who's going to say, I'm reading your mind, I pick the number that you pick too. You know, this is really a prediction writing effect, and I think it targets more uh, the mentalist, the professional mentalist. Uh, certainly easy for walk around, certainly easy for any venue, but I think it does lend itself to mentalism. All right, so that is the band writer from Vernet, and I would like to thank the people down at Murphy's Magic Supplies for allowing me to have this trick so that I could do this review for you. And if you want to purchase your own, you can find it at your favorite Murphy's Magic dealer. Thanks, bye.